Let me tell you a little story about a man named Woodrow Wilson. Born in Staunton, Virginia on December 28, 1856, he would become the first president to earn a PhD. It is suspected that Woodrow Wilson was dyslexic, as he didn't learn how to read until he was 10 years old. Determined not to be held back, he earned his bachelor's at Princeton University. At 29, he married Ellen Louise Axon and together raised three children. He served as a lawyer, president of Princeton University, and governor of New Jersey. In 1912, Woodrow Wilson became the nation's 28th president. Two years later, his first wife died making him one of three presidents to be widowed in office. A year later, he married Edith Galt. He was the first president since John Adams to deliver a State of the Union address before Congress. While in office, he managed America's involvement in World War I and formed the League of Nations, for which he was awarded the Nobel Peace Prize. In 1919, he suffered a serious stroke, which left him blind and paralyzed. On February 3, 1924, Woodrow Wilson died at the age of 67. He is the only president to be buried in Washington, D.C. And there you go, a little story about a man named Woodrow.